All right, chapter 10 officially, y'all. Now we know. Now we know. Let's do this. We got a workbench. Let's pick up my homie. My scav bot homie is here. I'm also tempted to look at the weapon situation and see if I can create anything cool. As much as I enjoy the shotgun and the machine gun, maybe we can make better versions of them. So let's take a look at the weapon crafting situation. Compact and a heavy. Okay. What I'm tempted to do is just look at blueprints. Because we got the pulse rifle. Classic high rate assault rifle with grenade launcher. Ooh, mama, that sounds good. That sounds delectable. I'm going to make that. Because why not? And you can take this spot right in y'all. So one of the bands that he's friends with just agreed that you could use one of your songs for their promo vid for your next collection, or for his next collection. And the name of him is Chaos Bleak. That's the name of the band, huh? Never heard of them, but hey. If they got cool music, cool. So wait, did that use my heavy standard frame? It must have. <clears throat> That's fine. I wanted the pulse rifle, so it's all good. Oh, you know what I didn't do, though? I probably have enough stuff to equip to this without needing to open up new slots. Let's see. So, damage. Yeah, see, these are all minus. Damn it. Hold on. Hold up. <coughs> hum, hum. Compact standard submachine gun. We're going to have to de uh, decontaminate you real quick, you know? Take off all the good stuff. Decontaminate's not the right word, but hey, whatever. Right. Chaos Bleak is on Spotify. Well, if I feel so inclined... I may check them out, good sir. Alright, let's add some damage, shall we? Clip it, damage it. Reload it, damage it. <clears throat> let's definitely add a clip on this one. Rate of fire and clip? Sure. Reload and clip. Uh, this one could definitely go for a clip or a rate of fire. This is the grenade launcher or whatever. Yeah, perfect. Cool. Just wondering if I should open up another slot on one of these guns, or if I should just spend it all on suit upgrades. I feel like the suit upgrades are more worth it, because you never know when you're going to want to switch up your guns. Is there a suit rig thing in here, though? I didn't see one. Do I have one of these? Hell yeah, I do. I'll have to make another one of those, too. That's what I'll go do at the workbench. I'll make another one of those. All right, give me the goods. Give me the goods. I'm actually excited to test out this pulse rifle, too. Pneumatic torch? Hello, potential flamethrower. Most likely. The flamethrower potential, potential is real. We will burn them to the ground. Give me all your things, baby. Girl, give me your things. Okay, mm -hmm. yeah, that must have been all for this room. The flamethrower was the real real catch oh yeah I should be walking around this pool just in case just to see where the next one is All right. bench bench hello bench hello 
I just want to craft one more of these bars just to have it on me. You never know. Hmm, I wonder if it's worth using some somatic gel to make a large med pack or something. I feel like we're not really low on med packs at the moment, though. We'll see. So it wants me to go that way. I came in from this door, I remember. Oh, my scavenger bot's back. Well, might as well pick them both up. Why not? I dilly-dallied long enough. Motherfucker showed up. Sounds good to me. Ooh, boy. Give me all them things. Oh, yeah. Cool. All right, moving on. Here we go. Smush. Not sure why that's locked, but sure. Locked doors. Hey, wait for Isaac. Isaac, we're just outside. Yeah, and we're freezing. Hurry your ass up. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna I'm on my way, douchebag. Anyway, how goes the dead space tomorrow? It's going. It's going alright. Making that progress slowly but steadily. Definitely not making as much progress as I was kinda hoping today. But that's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, here's all my friendos. Hey, friendos. Hello. Everybody well, that's not good. don't think whoever's in there is friendly. Oh, no. Cover fire. L-O. Okay. Damn it, Mauro. I was gonna, I was gonna ask the same question that Allegory just asked, but now I gotta read it out loud. So Mauro's like, I think I need to go to the hospital. That sounds concerning. Why? Because I can't see anything with my eyes closed. <laughs> Damn it, Mauro. Damn it. <laughs> Good one, though. Fuckers. Um, could you please duck? Headshot. Oh, come on. Give me that, bitch. Anybody else? Are we clear? Seem to be pretty clear. Ooh, that one had 20 fucking tungsten in it. I like this. Scabbot? 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 Algor said Scabbot. We looking. Hold on, I'm stomping out a bunch of douchebags. Don't mind me. You douchebag! Fuck you. I think human bodies must just drop their shit without me stomping them out. But fuck it. Stomping them anyways. Feels gratifying. All of your ideas are caused by your perverted imagination, Morrow. Same. Well, maybe not all my ideas. I feel like some of it's clever, but yeah. Here's my spot. So then you always see things when you close your eyes, mostly perverted things. Got it, yeah? Sounds about, sounds about Morrow. Until she falls asleep, of course. Then you... Then you um, yeah. Oh. Oh. I think we have a rain happening, children. Indeed. Let's go. Holy moly. Holy... A double raid. Wait, you're right. It's a double fucking raid. Double... Double trouble double raid. Holy crap. How did that happen? 
How did that happen? Let's shout these fuckers out. DJ, Mullet Wester, and Professor Jam with the fucking raids. I love it. Let's go. Anyway, the double back-to-back -back raid. Appreciate it, y'all. Appreciate it. And uh, welcome to the stream, all, all the raiders. Um, and thank you for the follow, Professor Jam, along with that raid. Hell yeah. Uh, I'm assuming y'all are here because I'm playing Dead Space. Very popular series of games. You know, another oh, uh, there's the good idea there might be go. to um, I'm watching. kill them while they're reach. funneling through the door and not stand back in the elevator. Five. Yeah. Because we don't have to wait for the elevator if we kill them all. Okay, how many are there? There's one, two, three, four, five. Oh my god. Okay. Did they hear me? Okay, that was great. That's RE5, Morrow, but I'll, I'll forgive you. And then here's one from Professor Jam. Some good old Seki roll. <laughs> That snake part is fucking terrifying, yo. We got two old clips from y'all. Nice. <laughs> nice. That eye stab, though. <laughs> well, then. Nice. Those are very two to get more gameplay heavy clips, but you know what? I I'll take it. Anyway, thanks for the raid, both y'all. How you doing tonight? I'm assuming y'all are here from Dead for Dead Space. I'm very much a variety streamer. I don't know if I recognize either of y'all from my streams before. I know Professor Jam and Mullet Wesker both just gave me follows, so I'm assuming they haven't been here before this and they found me through the game. Like, look at this. You got another? Yes. Did you shout them out this twice? Is all that's showing up on my screen right now. It's not even like responding. It's just this. What did you do? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? Is, what did you do to my computer? What? Is this some sort of Danish trick? <laughs> that was pretty silly. But anyway, uh, yeah. What was I saying? Oh, but I'm I'm a variety streamer. Thanks for finding me, and thanks for the. Uh, Thanks for the raid. You guys were co-oping the game, I see. Well, I'm playing it solo for the first time ever. I've played the first two games. Uh, a couple years back is when I last played the second game. Obviously, I played them in order. And, uh, well, it was only natural I'd eventually play this game. And here I am. And I have to say, it's kind of underwhelming compared to the first two games. They really try to get you with the jump scares way more in this one. Like, they're, these motherfuckers are popping out of everywhere. And I'm just like, God damn, quit it. Yeah, definitely my first playthrough of this game. Blind playthrough, as I like to call it, even though Twitch don't want me to call it that no mo. But yeah, um, I'm very much a variety streamer. Uh, for those of you who are new, including the Raiders, uh, the new you know Raid guys, um, tomorrow I'll be actually be starting a blind playthrough of Fallout New Vegas. So if that interests you at all... Hey, what's the tale this year? I've never played that game, even though I have played Fallout 3, yeah. well, but I did. never Ellie, played New Vegas. Can you make it to the warehouse? Oh, God. Here they come. Ellie. So if that tickles your fancy, come on back. Come on back tomorrow. I'll be doing that. Around the same time, I usually, I'm, I'm on the West Coast, so I usually start around 5 p.m. PST. That's when I'm done with work stuff, usually. And today I'll be a short stream. I'll probably only be going for another half hour here or so. But tomorrow will be a longer stream. Probably go for about four or five hours. But yeah. That is the plan. I figured I'd give you all a heads up now. I don't know why the YouTube thing didn't work tomorrow. There's definitely a bot thing. Oh. 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 I just realized. My actual cloud bot that, you know, handles all my commands... Is not work is not currently on. That would be helpful. Um, I might want to turn that on, huh? Maybe I'll do that right now. I did fuck up because when I got back when I got back home yesterday, I had to restart my computer and I completely forgot about the bot. 
I was a little preoccupied today, okay? I was busy with work, so I didn't really have time to prepare the stream for long. I was just like, I'm ready to play. Let's just load this bitch up and go. Anyway, I'm almost... I'm almost to the point where you guys are at in the game, mullet. Oh, okay. And jam, mullet and jam. You forgive me? Oh, thanks, Mara. I, I only live for your forgiveness. Once I have that, everything is okay again. <laughs> all right. Um, I guess that's all for this room. Oh, I should have been looking to see if there was a thing in this area. There's not. Okay. <laughs> Don't make me clap them cheeks. Oh, I'll make you. And you'll do it whether you want to, whether I want you to or not, anyways. Something went blow boom. I was trying to get items though. Oh shit! Hello. Down in front. Knee cap him. Huh? Are these all bad guys? I'm assuming these are all bad guys. Like, I, I get that the creatures are definitely the bad guys, but I'm assuming all these dudes with guns are also bad. So mow them all down. Got it. Well, I'm actually playing this on my PS3. Uh, I got this game on for free on PlayStation Plus a long, long-ass time ago, and I figured, eh, why buy it? I'm probably not going to like it that much, so I might as well just fucking just play it on the copy I already have, so yeah. If it is not you or Carver, then they're bad guys? Okay, got it. Noted. The right attitude for this game? Yeah, I didn't want to spend money since I already had a access to it. That's, that's kind of what I went with. If I thought I was going to like love this game, I would have been like, alright, fuck it, I'll buy the PC version. I got a good-ass PC now, why not? I have Dead Space 1 and 2 on PC, thanks to our boy Allegory in the chat here. He actually hooked me up with copies of those on Steam. That's how I played these games in the first place. So big thanks to him again. There you go. Save my money for the microtransactions for show. Also, uh, you're sleepy as hell, Mullet Wesker. You're out of here. All right, man. Thank you. And yes, have a good night. Thank you for the raid again and appreciate the follow. And uh, yeah, if you want to come back to Fallout, I'll see you then if you show up. So yeah. But yeah, if, you're, if your time zone is like, you're, it's de definitely bedtime for you, then yeah, probably won't work out hanging out in my streams live. But hey. I do have a lot of shit on YouTube, as Mario tried to show you. So, uh, if you're interested, I have tons of playthroughs. I've been doing this a long ass time. Yes, Allegory, you are the one that gave me Dead Space 1 and 2. Did you forget? Obviously. Ellie, everyone all right? Yeah, I think we're safe. We are anything An elephant never safe. forgets. They're after Isaac, and we're getting caught in the crossfire. Look, the warehouse. The signal tracking experiment should be inside. You're not worth as much trouble, Clark. Wow. That's fine. I'm not coming to save you either, dickbag. I'm just coming in here to whoop some ass and save the boobs. Directed suspension field, huh? Hmm. Fair enough, Allegory. You gift so many things. How could you possibly remember them all? 10 p.m. is too late for us old people. Well, if you got, like, work in the morning, 10 p.m. makes sense if you got to sleep. Can't hate on that. I need more scrap metal, damn it. Eesh. I need more semiconductors, damn it. Sorry, we could do some of this other stuff. Um, You know what? I should do this one so we have more stasis energy in general. That's a good idea. It's 10 p.m. Do you know where your booze is? Uh, Yeah. Downstairs, chilling. Or it's in the fridge, like Morrow said. You know what? Let's max out the range on my Kinesis, because why not? Because why not? I got plenty of tungsten at the moment. The real thing I'm falling short of is scrap metal and transducers, which I guess I shouldn't be that surprised. Which means I can use some tungsten and upgrade my weapons. Let's do it. Definitely you should uh, invest in an ice cube tray there, Maro. Especially if you want to partake in some of your drinks in the cold. In the cold. Just 
10 p.m. We just getting started. Well, true, technically true. No, this is my short stream day. <clears throat> All right, I'm gonna craft what? I already have a torque bar thing, so I'm just gonna craft macaroni and cheese. I'm gonna make some upgrade slots for these. Mainly this. I'm gonna max out. Oh, oh. It upgrades the slots for all the guns. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I didn't know that. I was not paying attention to that. Okay, well, now I know. Awesome. Fucking awesome. All right, plus two damage, minus one reload. I don't really need an extra clip, if I'm going to be real. My damage is already maxed out, though. So there's really no reason to add more damage. So rate of fire is probably my better bet. Thing is, it doesn't really add much. Like, it adds very, very little. And I never use this lower thing. What even is this? I don't even know, dude. I don't even know, dude. Um, ammo, ammo, ammo. So this gun doesn't really need reload speed, so anything minus reload would be okay. It's like this one's probably great. Let's do that. And then this other slut. Let's add some damage would be great. Uh, we don't need more rate of fire on that. Clip's already low on that one anyways. So it's probably fine to just throw that on there. All right, cool. Upgrades for the win. Cool, so we maxed out all of my weapon slots. That's done. Now we don't have to worry about that anymore. Bitchin'. Now we're really just saving up tungsten and all the other materials to max out my suit. Kick ace. Let's go. Moving on. Wait. Did I... I didn't check this area, did I? No, I didn't. Okay. We're good. Moving on. And I'm glad you and your family are all healthy again, Drew. Glad to hear you guys were literally all sick. Also, oh, hell no, sir. I mean, y'all can fight each other. I'll just take out whoever survives. Who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? Wow, humans are fragile. Fragile fucks. Decap him. Place your bets now. <laughs> Who's going to win? I know, right? Bitch. I hear monsters. Shit. Got him. Has anyone here played Birth by Sleep, the Kingdom Hearts spinoff? Are you asking me? Because you know I already played all the Kingdom Hearts games, sir. All right. Birth by Sleep is actually pretty good, um, Drew. Compared to some of the other spinoff stuff, Birth by Sleep is pretty good. I'm just glad to have no more coughing in the background of your streams. <laughs> true dat, true dat. But yes, I've played all the Kingdom Hearts games. The best ones are Kingdom Hearts 1, 2, and Birth by Sleep. So if you haven't played Birth by Sleep, I recommend it. It's pretty decent. It's definitely the third best of the three. 
definitely goes in the order of Kingdom Hearts 2, Kingdom Hearts 1, then Birth by Sleep. But yeah. <sighs> Which way am I supposed to go? That way. Okay, what's over here? Anything key? Want to see something cool? Two is the best because of Roxas. I wouldn't say it's because of Roxas, but Roxas is good. Scabbot sound. Good call. I should have already been checking. There's literally one right here. Good call. You weren't a big fan of the battle system allegory? Uh, on the PSP, I can concur. Not my favorite. But playing it on the PS3 collection or whatever I played it on. Yeah, PS3 was a much better experience in my opinion i hated playing it on psp i fucking hated it because psp can suck my nads forever yeah it's not a bad game drew it's not bad don't don't be discouraged just because you don't know anything about it it's actually not bad it's a pretty decent story it, i would say it goes by pretty fast most kingdom hearts games aren't very very long like they're they can be kind of long but only if you like literally do all the things and try to challenge yourself to do all the hardest stuff but you can usually fly through kingdom hearts games pretty quickly just in general okay i intercepted transmission we must intercept transmission we must replace his transmission Anybody else want some? Just one fella? Just one fella? No more fellas? What I just pick up? Artifacts. Okay, going in. Don't be scared. Frog doesn't know nothing about the Kingdom Hearts games. Well, doesn't surprise me, Frog. A little bit past your time, I would say. Only reason I say that is because you couldn't see by the time they came out. Oh, well, there was the monster dropped in my head. There's also a Big Boy in front of me. Can I fucking get out of here, please? No, seriously. Can I? Can I? Thank you fucking dead ass body parts all up in my way and shit. Cheating. Cheating. Oh, is this the creature we killed earlier or fought earlier? It looks similar. It looks like the same. Maybe it's not the exact same one, but it's the same kind of creature. And always, always stomp the dead bodies because they could potentially become enemies later. Okay then, stop him at any cost. You heard the man. If, does he ad lib colorfully though? I only ad lib colorfully when there's not a lot of reading, or when there is a lot of reading rather. If there's not a lot of reading, I have no reason. Also, what the? F How am I gonna not have enough space for the coolest thing I found the whole game? Fucking Hammond's heavy frame, and I ain't got space for that shit. Mm -mm. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck, fuck that. See ya, Stasis. Don't care. Hardly knew ya. If I had to describe how colorfully that funky ad libs are, I'd have to pick the color chartreuse. Sure. Just because it's fancy sounding? This is the only way he could have come. Be ready. Be ready. Oh, I'm always ready. Boy. Oh, shit. Watch out. Dive. Don't hurt me. All right, sir, you not. Oh, shit, dude. Okay. Can I get some help here, creatures? I need some. I need a little backup. Where's the creatures at for backup? Got 
got this. Don't worry, I got this. Oh, what the? Bitch. I said I got this. That doesn't mean you can shoot. Bitch. Bitch. I want your money, not your life. Oh, wait. You know what? Scratch that. In this game, I'm taking the life. Never mind. <laughs> There's a storage thing over here. Oh, this is co-op only. That's odd, but okay. Noted. Oh, I'm going to run out of fucking space again. Anyway, I'm glad you guys enjoyed my ad-libbing. I, I try to be funny when I'm doing voices, you know, between... The Russian one, which I just did a minute ago, or the, you know, the Barrett voice in Final Fantasy VII, or the old people voice, which I always have fun with, no matter who's an old person in any video game. Always a good time. 50 away from that hot 1K. You gonna do anything special once I hit that? I don't know. 1K followers is pretty big, I'm not gonna lie. I probably should do something special. Just I just don't know do what- it! Make your dreams come true! I'm trying, Drew. I'm trying. Should I make a poll? <laughs> I should... <laughs> Fuck, sorry. I laughed as I drank that water. Fuck. <laughs> sorry, I'm dying. Don't mind me, I'm just dying. <laughs> I needed a sip of water and they fucked it up. Damn you and your ridiculousness. <laughs> do a whole playthrough with a Russian accent for a thousand, that would be um, pretty tough to do for a whole stream. But yeah. You like doing that southern voice there, Drew? Southern voice is a good old grand old time, you know what I'm saying? Me and the, me and the boys are gonna go out there and shoot some motherfuckers up, you know what I'm saying? Let's do this, y'all. We're being slaughtered. Well, stop getting slaughtered, you silly bitches. Um, you don't look like a good time. Am I going to have to shotgun you? Oh, you are alive and have a gun. That's not okay. That's not okay. You have a gun, and... You're like a five-year-old with a laser gun. No. Not okay. You're you're not okay. Just FYI. You're not okay. Oh, I see. They're being brought to life by these little fucking shit. Also, can you, like, stay dead, sir? Not getting brought back to life. You don't have the limbs to be alive, sir. I couldn't even see that fucker. He was so close to me. What a bitch. Snooty rich person voice. I'm, I like that one too. Allegory. I mean, I got to go to for a lot of those basic bitch voices. You know, like the country and the... The snotty, snooty, Bianchio voice. If you watch me play Rumpa, you're going to hear that many, many times. For he is a douchebag with glasses. And he does not like anybody except for he lasts. And he lasts forever. Throw that ass in a circle. You recently watched my Xenogears Let's Play and loved the southern drawl you gave one of the characters? I don't even remember. Oh, did I give that to Billy? I don't even remember who I gave what voice in that game. Edge's ghetto voice in Final Fantasy 4. Dude, I don't even remember what I did with Final Fantasy 4. Oh my god. I need to go back and actually check that shit out. You're thinking of doing all the Crash Bandicoots working up to 4, but you might get pissed on stream, so I don't know. I mean, it's okay to be mad, Drew. For content! It's what I do. It's what I do. By the way, what time is it? I gotta try and finish this chapter, I think. 
Oh my god. It's a massacre! A massacre! Oh, shoot! He's still alive! Why? Oh boy. Oh god. Pourquoi, massacre? Oh shit. Damn it, I hate when this fucking thing come back to life. Super annoying. Oh, it's on me. It's on me. Get off of me. Oh, God. Reload. Betch. Betch. And yes, my bot is... I. I fixed it, Morrow. After you made me realize I had it off, I turned it on. So, bot's back. Just FYI. The bot is back online. The bot is back online. The shadow command was still working because the shadow command is actually separate from uh, that bot. It's a different bot. So, luckily, that was still working when we shouted out the, the raid from earlier. <clears throat> Yeah, dude, if you get angry, people like it. Allegory can attest. So can I. Oh, this is a co-op thing, isn't it? <clears throat> oh, no, you could do this by yourself. Oh, shit, what the, the fuck? Where'd you come from, bitch? I'm a little busy here. I'm a little busy here, you piece of shit. How dare you? But yes, anything that's relatable. Jump scared, anger, sadness, happiness, hilarity, all those things, all the above. That gets people into your shit, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> what stipulation should you have if you drink during crash? Because if you drink on death, you will die. Yeah, drinking on Death of Crash would probably be a bad idea. Don't do that. <clears throat> Maybe drink on a... I'm trying to think how those games are set up. <sighs> Did I do it? I did it. Just drink whenever you hear a little bit of God. I mean, that happens just as much as he would die probably tomorrow. So how about now? <laughs> I'm at the coring platform, y'all. My favorite platform, the coring one. I have not, and I repeat, I have not been checking my bot thing. Hopefully I haven't missed any... Aglory hasn't called any out recently, so hopefully I didn't miss any. Well, let's see. On the first Crash Bandicoot, it's not really broken up into worlds, but when you get to Crash Bandicoot, like, three, uh, two and three, it's broken into worlds, so you could, like, finish a world and then take a shot every world. There's five worlds in each game, I believe. You can do it that way. Can I please activate this, motherfucker? Thank you. <laughs> yeah, for the first crash, you could just be like, for each boss. The bosses, is, there are bosses. What in the fuck should I just activate? There's an obstruction, I guess. Terrifying obstruction, but it's it's an obstruction. An obstruction of justice. Can I please activate the bench? I'm just trying to use it. Thank you, game. Thank you. Alright, telemetry spike, Hammond's heavy frame. Good stuff, good stuff. I was saving stuff for suit upgrades, right? So we'll just save it till then for now.
Okay. Um, oh, 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 oh. I didn't see that. I walked right up about that. Don't want to miss that because that's something good. That's some good. That's some good. I like them good, good. Well, um, you don't like it? Drill block in my way out. Maybe I can lower the safety gates. Is that wise? One way to find out. It's never wise. Hold on. I'm gonna get out of the way because something's gonna fucking fly right at me if I don't do care. If I stand right there, I will die. I almost guarantee. Fucking tea. It's like a poor spot to be standing. Oh boy. Oh God! I see. That's how you survive. I got it. Now I know why the stasis thing is there. Stasis says, "Got it going on. It's gonna stop that drill for so long, so I don't die and get fucking crushed." I know it might be wrong, but stasis is the bomb. Fuck right off, good sirs. I need to stop that thing again before it crashes my soul. Thank you. Quit chasing. Cut it in. Decapped, son. Oh shit, it's coming right for us. That was nice. That space is like all the fuckers. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I need to reload. See, the thing is, what am I doing? Pray tell, what is it? that I'm supposed to do here. Is there a particular goal in mind? What am I to do? I really am not 100% sure. Unless now that I clear everything out, something's gonna happen. Seem like it. Um, what am I missing? I'm clearly missing something here. Shoot inside! I didn't even notice. Drill core at seventy-five percent capacity. There we go. Resuming operation. Oh shit! It's not done though. Hold on. Four, three, two, one. All hands, clear the deck. Clear the deck. Holy sh dude! Fucking calm your titties. Oh shit, there's a dude behind me. There's a couple dudes. A lot of dudes. Please don't kill me. There's too many dudes. I must have done the damage. Also, I have no attention for the chat at the moment, so you have to have to forgive me. Yes, please! What have we done? Fatal 
drill defeated. All right. Okay, Ellie. We're headed to the warehouse now. Is everything okay? Oh, yeah. Between this planet trying to kill us, your boyfriend hating me, this has been a wonderful trip so far. Well, not usually like this. I don't know why. He... Just let us fight it out, okay? One of us will win eventually. Did you find the experiment? Yes. And? You'll just have to see it. Oh, good. One of us will win eventually. Yeah, it's gonna be me. Haven't you heard the NSYNC song? <laughs> it's gonna be me. That's already me. Let's go back and read the chat that I missed during that fight, shall we? Um, how much fun would it be to commentate that race? And it looks like Drew is in the lead. Oh, I see. When when Morrow and Drew are doing their Resident Evil 2 commentary uh, race, that would be interesting. Mr. X surprises him in through the library door, forcing him to reroute and giving Morrow a chance to take the lead. Can she limp back from this and take the gold? Who knows? If you could actually do that and make it sound that good while you're doing it live, I'd be down for that. All right. Um. That is a very interesting technology of that drill, though. Drill is being damaged. Give us five seconds, and we'll do whatever we can. I forgot to check to see if there was a thing over there. Hopefully there wasn't, because I forgot to check. Stasis pack has got it going on. It refills my stasis all the way on. Don't let him wake up. Potential enemies everywhere. Stomp them out. Quickly. There is a scab bot down here. I mean, I was going to check. There definitely is one here. All right. Is there another one here? Okay. Must be the next set of things. All righty then. All righty then. Let's see how close I am to the end of this chapter, because I'm getting close to where I want to stop. We're only on 27% completion of this chapter. My goodness. This is either a really long-ass chapter, or I don't know. Technically, this game auto saves Morrow, but man, it's a weird, um, it's a weird system. It likes to make you lose your progress. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. There are checkpoints, though. I just haven't been paying attention if there has been one, but it does have what the game would call auto saving. Loosely defined auto saving. for the machine's control signal, broadcasting it to the smaller forms. And that helps us how? Because I think they found the machine by tracking the signal upstream through nerve clusters inside the creature. Oh, wait. We need to get inside that thing? Yes. This is such a wonderful opportunity. Wonderful opportunity. The son of a bitch is frozen solid. How do we get in? The scientists use heat exchanges. Let me try to ignite them. No, no good. We have to go inside of this big ass, nasty ass bug thing. Isaac, be careful up there, right? Yeah. That's cool. That's a checkpoint. That's definitely a checkpoint. Progress saving right now. If there was ever a point where there's a checkpoint, this is that point. So I might call this session right here, right now. 
I know we're not done with the chapter, clearly, but I do know that we did just fight like a drill boss situation, and that was fun and everything. I bet I'm better off stopping now before we get into the next big old thing. As long as we're following the main story, it does have decent auto save points, so it's all good. So yeah, thank you all for hanging out on this edition of Dead Space 3. Hopefully you're enjoying, and next time, I guess we're going inside of that big-ass thing. That should be a fun time. Yay, can't wait. Kind of, but not really. <sighs> all right, well, I guess that's all. I'll see you guys when we do that. Peace!